This is a review and audio test recording of the Asben Mics HQ-M mono lavalier microphone. They also make a version that can plug into the Sennheiser wireless microphone systems as well. The only difference being, being the connector with that one. It has like a little neural uh, connector that you can screw into the uh, Sennheiser system. Anyway, uh, this again is the Asben Mics HQM mono lavalier microphone, and I think it's a really good microphone for the price. Uh, it's only about for $45 to $50. Comes with a five year warranty, and uh, looking on their website, it says it's a professional lavalier, extremely low noise, high quality audio, omnidirectional condenser microphone. It has the 3.5 millimeter, uh, 1 8 inch mini mono jack for mono devices. Again, it's a uh, lavalier microphone, so you can uh, pin it to your shirt or lapel for on-screen you know, purposes. It has a very discreet size as well. And it comes in this nice little tin here, as you can see. So it's got a simple packaging, um, sort of reminds me of an Altoids tin or something like that. But it's great for presenters, lecturers, interviewers, on-screen talent, journalism, etc. And Asben Mics is a little bit of a smaller company, so I think it's kind of uh, you know cool to support uh, small companies, small audio companies like Asben Mics. Uh, I have done a video review of their stereo version in the past, so check out uh, my video on that as well. And I know that I'll get some questions about uh, how I'm recording this or what recording device I'm using. I am using my iPhone to record this and I'm actually using the Rode uh, recording uh, application, I think it's called Rode Rec, to record uh, into my iPhone. And I'm using a Rode adapter as well because you do need to convert the Asben mono lavalier microphone into a tip ring ring sleeve configuration uh, when you go into a smartphone like the iPhone. Uh, so I'm using a Rode adapter for that as well. The app does allow me to set the microphone input gain level manually, so I do have that set. And I have no other processing or anything done to my voice or anything like that, so it's pretty much the raw audio just with levels set on this recording. I think it does a pretty good job for the price. Again, this has been my look and audio test of the Asben Mics HQM Mono Lavular Microphone. For pricing and availability, check the description field, and for community and discussion, check the comments field. Thanks for listening.